In this video, Delio is going to show you how to apply perforated window vinyl. But instead of choosing an easy project, we're going to demonstrate the application process on a difficult window, the back glass of a Jeep that has hinges and a handle to work around. After this, applying window perf to any flat glass windows will be easy for you. Today we're going to be installing window perf on the back of this vehicle. We're going to start with this deep cleaner that comes with the kit. We're going to spray the window down. Let's take a paper towel and wipe it down. We're going to do it on this window today because it's got all these little difficult things around it. Once you clean it down with that, you want to use some regular rubbing alcohol and spray it down and wipe it down again. We're using the alcohol, you know, it dries up quick and evaporates, so it, it's better for the application because you don't want it to be wet. As you can tell, this is oversized. It's so you can fit it all on there. You can trim it down, you'll trim it down last. Just want to tape this up there to hold it. Make sure you cover all the window. I'm going to cut a little bit of this off the bottom. I'm cutting it off the bottom to make it a little easier with this right here because of this. Just try to make it where it won't stick out as bad. I'm going to cut this right here because of this little spray nozzle. On this particular application, I'm going to fold this like backwards like this. I'm going to start in the middle in the top. Just work my way down. Trying to keep this nice and even. I'm just going to try and go up under this this buckle up here. See if I can just push this up to it. Just want to work it back to it. You don't want to work away from it. You just want to let your squeegee just go over it and press it down the other side and work it back to it. See how this little bubble around it. Remove the tape. I'm going to fold this back. Grab your backing paper. Use your squeegee and just work it in. Just applying it nice and easy. I'm going to leave this down here because of this. Do it last. Get into this other little thing here, just grab your squeegee over it, press it down to it. Now we're going to mess with this. You need to cut that.
Now you just take a knife and cut it out. Any of these little bubbles, you just take a safety pin or a knife or anything you got, just pop them like this, just pop one of the little holes and you can just rub that air right out of there. And now we'll go up here to this and I'm basically just going to cut a little bit on the buckle so that way if I cut it up a little short, I can still, I can still manage it. You see it's got all these like little tiny bubbles in it everywhere. This is where the air is trapped up under there. Eventually when you get it out in the sun, th those will disappear. It'll flatten out and it'll, it'll, look, it'll look like it's supposed to look. Except for you just want to get the bigger bubbles out. All right, we're gonna move on down to this little buckles down here. I'm just gonna simply put my knife on it like this and just try to trace this little circle out without cutting too far away from the from it so I, I don't have any window showing Go over here and repeat that same process. And then after that, you just go around and trim out the excess. You just gotta make sure that all the purpose down so you see if it's touching the car and not touching the window then if you cut it away you might cut it away and it might be come up short just put your knife blade against the window and just let it let the, let the window guide your blade Start from up here again. And that's it. As always, if you still have questions, we're here to help. Thanks for watching.